Today, Ohio Governor Mike DeWine and Lieutenant Governor John Husted announced state support for 112 brownfield remediation projects. They say it will help clean up contaminated properties in Ohio and make way for future economic development. Five are in Mahoney County. You can see them on this map. Three in Youngstown, one in Struthers, another in Sebring. One project is the old Strauss department store. First News anchor Stan Boney is live tonight to tell us what this all means. Well, when those announcements were made today, we learned that the city of Youngstown will be getting $6.9 million from those brownfield remediation grants to renovate and redo what is known as 20 Federal Place, or the old Strauss building that you see behind me. The original plan for it, the one that was presented to the state, is to totally renovate the entire building. The first floor will become kind of like a west side market type of like a, uh, facility. As you work your way up, then there will be apartments in there. There'll be retail space. There'll be a apartments in there as well. And on the top of the building, the plan is for a rooftop bar. So this is a, a huge uh, money, uh, amount of money that's coming to the city of Youngstown and will be put to use to redo the Strauss building or 20 Federal Place, as it's called. Joining me now is Julius Oliver. He's the councilman from the first ward. When this is his ward, when you heard this, what was your reaction? I mean, I was ecstatic. Uh, I, I can't even... Um put into words how happy I was to hear that this project is moving forward and it's actually going to happen. What will it mean for downtown, especially this block of downtown? Uh, basically what it'll do is add another official anchor to the center of downtown. So this will be the place, the the official market, the, the jewel of the city right along with the hotel that says, you know, come on downtown, we got things for you to do, we got amenities for you to enjoy. The plan that was presented to council, are you on board with it? You like what you see there? Absolutely. It's a plan that's been a long time in the works, um, and this is just one more key in that public-private relationship. Um, this unlocks the door for, for more funding to make that plan go to, go, to, go to bat. Of the five grants that Mahoning County got, three of them are coming to your first ward. How'd you pull that one off? Um, basically, it, it's a partnership. It's collaboration between, you know, the land bank, the governor, the city, uh, the administration, my council colleagues. You know, when, when, the, when the government sees collaboration, then they like to fund those things. They like to fund good plans that have a solid concrete base. And this plan goes right along with what we've been doing for Phelps Street to get you from the university down to the amphitheater. All right, Julius, thanks a lot. Thank Once you. again, $6.9 million coming to the city of Youngstown to totally renovate 20 Federal Place. Live in Youngstown, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News.